Imagine you're playing Call of Duty Black Ops 2. If you head to the big screen at the middle of the Nuketown 2025 map, you can play old Atari games. It's an Easter egg. So in the late 70s, there was this dude, Warren Robinette, and he worked on the game Creator of Adventure for Atari. It was the first action adventure game, but he's pissed because Atari treats its artists terribly. They've got no royalties, no name on the box, and no external recognition. So Warren hatches a sneaky plan. He's like, I'll hide my name in the game. It'll be in a secret room that's really hard to get to, but when you do, the screen will fill up with a flashing moving marquee that says, Created by Warren Robinette. And that's what he did. The game goes live, and Atari ships out 200,000 copies before noticing anything's wrong. But when they do, Robinette thinks his boss is going to be livid, and he's like, I love it. Hidden surprises in video games. It's like waking up on Easter morning and going to find hidden colored Easter eggs in the garden. Good work, Robinette.